Hey guys, this is Ivan with Overlook DNT, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to transfer your Xbox 360 World over to your Xbox One. Bam. All right. Main reason for this video is that this is going to be a two part video. Uh, 4J just released an update that will allow us to take our 360 Worlds, throw them on our Xbox Ones, which has already been a thing, but to increase the size of them. Okay. So, uh, instead of rolling it into one long video, I'm going to just do two quick videos. So how do you take your worlds over to your Xbox One? Very simple. You start your 360 Xbox Minecraft experience of awesomeness. You go into the little files here. And I have one in mind. We're going to do the building with Sausage World. So this is all you have to do. You see at the bottom there it says Y upload save for Xbox One. Let's do it. So basically this is going to take a little bit of time. Not too much time. Don't turn off your Xbox, don't hit cancel, don't do anything drastic, just let it do its thing. Uh, once this is done, I'm going to take you over to the Xbox One, and I'm going to show you how to retrieve the save. And then we'll be done. Then after that, there will be a part two to the video as to how to increase the size of this world. Alright, so let's just finish, let's just let this finish, that way I can say hey, hope you guys like the video, and do all that outro stuff that I normally do. Come on! Go, 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 go! Don't you let the Xbox One say it's better than you even though it is. Show them you still have what it takes. Alright, I think it's done. Fantastic! Upload save for Xbox One. Upload complete. Thank you 360. If it wasn't for Terraria, I would uh, never turn you on again. Even though Terraria is out for the uh, Xbox One. I'm not paying full price for that. Can't even transfer my save. <laughs> I guess that's funny considering that's what we're talking about. Alright guys, I will see you on the Xbox One. Alright guys, and we're back over on the sexy Xbox One edition. And actually, that's kind of weird. I like the um, I like the colors better on the uh, 360. I mean, I'm running it through the same HD PBR. The settings are pretty much, I mean, they're exactly the same in the sense of opacity. I mean, transparency and, and the gamma and stuff. I don't know. It looks a bit sharper on the 360 now that I look at them back to back. All right. But how do you bring your save over? Let's go to play game. We're going to hit X to retrieve your Xbox 360 save. Now, keep in mind that you have to do one at a time. You can't stack saves. So I can't just hit X, 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 or I mean, actually, was it Y? Y on the 360 all kinds of times and then somehow imagine that they're stacked here ready for me to hit X on it. No, you have to do one at a time. It's like a Q. So right now, it should be building with sausage that's queued up. And because I hit the uh, X to retrieve my save, that should be the one that we get over. Let's see if that's the case. Come on! Don't make me look bad. Converting. Converting. Downloading. Format complete. Done, son! Where is it? Oh, there it is. There it is. Sausage. Building with sausage. Alright. Uh, so as you can tell, let's say this is uh, what you're going to do. Uh, you know, I'm going to save this for the next video. As you can tell, there's no special options besides the usual ones. Alright, well, fantastic. I hope you guys liked the video. If you're interested in figuring out how to make these worlds larger, then uh, I'll put it in an annotation. Uh, and I'll put it in the description, the link on how to do so. So I hope you guys liked the video. As always, subscribe up top and peace out.